back, you demonic freaks, to the Lucid Nightmare. I'm your host as always, Jay Schatzer. And today I've got a great British powerhouse flick. It is Jack Tornare's 1957 classic. It is Night of the Demon. And this one is just pure magic in celluloid form. Let's just dive into this great, great flick. Here is Night of the Demon. Night of the Demon, aka Curse of the Demon, is a wild and fanciful British horror film which is a washed in film noir style in abundant and devilish tone. Lensed in a moody black and white palette, this thrilling production excellently projects a sense of doom and despair for its main characters, as we are propelled into a cinematic world filled with deadly curses and maleficent magicians. When it comes to UK horror productions, none come off more haunting than Night of the Demon. The film follows professional skeptic Dr. John Holden as he travels to London in order to attend a paranormal psychology symposium after the untimely death of his fellow colleague and friend, Professor Harrington. At the center of this mystery is an eccentric cult leader named Julian Carswell who claims to have the power to control unimaginable forces and claims to have cursed Professor Harrington resulting in his brutal murder. Suspicious of Carswell, Dr. Holden embarks on a thrilling mission to dispel his wild claims, yet the deeper he gets into the mystery, the more evident it appears that the man truly is in control of demonic powers. Will John Holden end up like his poor departed colleague, or can he find aid in the unlikely hands of Professor Harrington's beautiful niece, Joanna Harrington? Only time can tell, but unfortunately for Dr. Holden, time is running out. Dana Andrews takes on the prolific role of Dr. John Holden, the professional debunker who unexpectedly comes to be the brand new owner of a demonic magician's death curse. Exceptionally headstrong and intellectually minded, Andrews imbues the character of John Holden with a charismatic demeanor, one that allows the audience to sympathize with his current predicament and unusual situation. Racing against time, Holden interjects a desperate nature to his character, after he finally comes to terms with the true severity of his situation. His portrayal is an honest one, and one that helps us get invested in all the otherworldly things that begin appearing as the film shifts into high gear. Butting heads with the aforementioned Dana Andrews is Niall McGuinness as magician extraordinaire Julian Carswell. As smug as they come and truly mean-spirited, McGuinness soars in the thorny role and his uncompassionate approach to the character is one that truly keeps on giving as the film presses along. He's a true son of a bitch, and McGinnis absolutely shines in the sinister position of the demon-wielding power-mad magician. Contrasting beautifully off of McGinnis's wild cult leader personality is Peggy Cummins as Joanna Harrington, the determined niece of the recently deceased Professor Harrington. Peggy's presence in this film is a welcomed one, and her adamant belief in the supernatural and the sinister intentions of Julian Carswell are what push this mystery along and really flesh out the narrative. In true horror thriller style, Night of the Demon is a wonderfully enchanted production filled with mystery and atmosphere around every corner. Lensed in a gloomy film noir sense and brooding with outlandish horror elements, the film is an interesting hybrid of various genre types, which combine to make a highly memorable and thoroughly unique cinematic experience. The special effects also aid in making this production something of an unforgettable gem. From its unsettling subject matter to its ultimately strange visual representation of its unforgettable demon, the film is an unorthodox entry in the horror genre that entertains in the most wondrous of ways. Haunting to the absolute last and drowning in maleficent intent, 
Night of the Demon is an outstanding British horror production that combines its various elements in order to make a truly remarkable feature with an added bonus of untamed terror. If you like your films to think outside of the box, then Night of the Demon is just what you're looking for. It's brash, outlandish, and wholly surprising, and in that aspect is exceptionally enjoyable. In summary, Night of the Demon is atmospheric film noir horror at its absolute best. And there you have it, ladies and gents. That is the fabulous Night of the Demon. Just a great British horror film with a whole bunch of atmosphere. Just check this one out as soon as you can. You won't be disappointed. But guys, that's it for me today. Hope you enjoyed that film, and I hope you like what I'm doing here. If you do, please like and subscribe. And if you have time, leave a comment below because I'd love to hear from you. But until then, I will see you at the next movie review. Take care.